how to connect Canva to Wix website. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I am going to show you how you can connect your uh, Canva website to the Wix website that you have created. The first thing is to follow up the tutorial from the beginning till the end and the next thing is to uh, make some focus on the information that I am going to give you and you are going to follow up the steps that are provided in this video and you will be good to go. Now we are on Wix.com and we have created our account and also we have signed in. As you can see we have here the website that uh, I have created and also I am on Canva then we have also the account logged in and I am going simply to my sites as uh, choose a website that I have running click on select and edit website it will be adding or it will be showing us the uh, dashboard of that website simply I will let uh, the 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 website editor load up click on edit site right here i will let it take its time now let's go back to the canva platform i am going simply to create a website let's go ahead and type website on the search bar then we will see the templates that are available it is very easy and very simple now we have some free templates and also some paid templates. Let's go ahead and add or customize a template that we can see right here. And then we are going to add some or uh, delete some elements that we don't need. Let's go with, for example, with this one. I like bakery. I will put this one, customize this template real quick. Well, let's uh, here see the editor. It will not take too much time to load up. Here we will wait for the editor of Canva. It is uh, abnormally taking some time. Here we have the template. As you can see here, we have the regular menu. I'm do I don't like these menus or so. I'm going simply to delete them. I'm going to make the background of this uh, one like that or maybe something like that this is better i think i'm going to make a little bit uh, something a little bit smaller i'm going to put this bar right here and here i'm going simply to edit the um the title and i'm going to put here smith this is uh, the, my branding for example smith and here loaf i'm going to put jack like here uh sour dough bread cheesecakes and more i'm going to add some elements for example on here uh cakes cake i'm going to see the graphics that we have and then we are going to add something like that i'm going to put this here and this one on this corner right here try to make it uh, similar to this one and put it right here it is not working properly go ahead and add this one instead release it right here now i'm going to add some text or some headings for example or a text box let's go and add um, here a presentation for uh, the website best like that best bakery uh, in the world for example this is just a, a presentation is not a true <laughs> I don't have a bakery I'm going to put uh, the font of this text right here something like that this is something bold and here we are going to add some of the headings for example i'm going to put home um put this as home make it smaller put it here and now i'm going to duplicate this one and put it uh besides it i'm going to name it for example products like that 
finally this one and I'm going to duplicate this for one more time and make it right for example catalog 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 like that uh, here I'm going to add a bonus section which is recipes Reci like that recipes like that make it uh near that and finally i'm going to put about us and here we have it this is the uh, the pages that we own in this website like that i'm going to add another page with the similar color branding that we have for example this and I'm going to add some elements, add another page to make it uh, look a little bit longer. Here we are going to add some elements. Simply, I'm going back right here, see the photos. Um, bakery. Let's see what do we have on the photos. This is a bakery. I'm going to use that image. It is a copyright free from Canva. This one. And maybe this one also uh, let's say and add this one I'm going to make it here and finally I'm going to put here then I will put a, between them a text box for example have lunch at our bakery it like that it is possible right now and here we have it put the text lunch like that I'm going to select everything right here put make it a little bit bigger like that make this one smaller to the uh, to have some lines like that select all of this Going to back, select all of that, make it like that, put the color on white, and here we have it. Make it a little bit bigger between those, and here we go. Now we are going to publish the website when we have finished the work right here. I'm going to put here publish website. Every, everything will be published soon. From Canva then we are going to see here the website that we have now until the published website I'm simply going back to the Wix now I'm going to add for example let's add an elements right here and I, I'm going to add a strip for example let's go ahead and drag and drop this one to this I'm going to attach it to this section and for this strip uh, you, you can get, go ahead and add a section for example and for this section you can go and add whatever you have about or you can put a blank section like that this is the blank section it is up to you to choose the width of that section now let's go back to Canva click on edit design again click on say here and here we are going to click on more now we have the website it is published I am simply going to click on embed when it, within the embed I will click again on embed and here we have the HTML code or HTML embed code copy this link go back to the Wix then add element as you can see here we are going to click on embed code click on that and simply embed HTML I am going to add a website right here here we have the website address if you want to add a website address but Canva gave us a HTTPS code I'm going simply to put this website and click on update and we will see here the uh, code right here of the website and as you can see the website is here I'm simply going to make it bigger to let the uh, visitors of my website see it let's go ahead and make it uh, this big 
and here we have it I'm going to make this uh, one larger and as you can see this is the section I'm going to put it right here we have the website we have the uh, the the photos you can go ahead and click for example uh, and uh, on the menu or on the object that are clickable you can see here we have some you can edit the code you can have some settings you can uh, update the code or you can see for example here the um, the website live I'm going simply to click on save then I will preview the website or this Wix website with the integration or the connection of the uh, Canva website that we have and as you can see it will uh, show up the website into pages that we can slide to this is the first page second page and the third page if you want to see the whole website all you have to do is to click on this navigator and here we have the full screen of the website that was very simple and very easy you can also put the uh, in the place of the HTML embed code the smart embed link as you can see here you click simply on copy on this smart here I am going to put a another element right here go ahead to the embed code again we are going to choose in the place of the embed HTML embed a site click on embed a site and here it will show you the HTML setting what do you want to add a website address I'm going to put the HTTPS here we have here canva.com slash design slash the series number of the design click on apply and right away you will see this um, website integrated right here you are going to make it bigger like that and you are good to go here you can go ahead and share this website or add some more we have here in this particular case the canva logo that uh, you can see it is um, appertaining or it is um, owned by canva and you can go ahead and click on it and you will be guided to the live website that was all for today's video thank you guys for watching i hope that you have enjoyed the content and see you soon on the next one